Alright everybody, good morning! Today is a wonderful Wednesday. It's August 26th. Yes! So let's go take a look around and see what's going on. Ah, the guys having their fun with the last little bit. Well, this is the white sand that they're using, the plaster coating. We still have a little bit of white sand, probably enough to do the fencing. We just need our S1 still. But we got lots of other things going on today. So let's go look. All right, and the plaster coating is busy. <laughs> They're fixing some tiles right now. It was hollow. For some reason, they had some hollow spots. So now, they gotta pop everything and redo it. There's a little bit of cleanup going on back here. They got the roofing done. Everything is all put together, from my understanding. So we're gonna go up there and uh, see. I think there's like a five centimeter gap that they're waiting. And the welder, busy making these accordion gates. This is actually gonna be the first one it's looking like that he is working on he's got everything cut out for another section of it so that's how tall is our gates going to be these guys right now is working on the sliding drawers for our wonderful drawers and these are the sliders they've already doubled it up i guess there's a bumper going on there they've been busy working on stuff not sure are these soft close kuya so they don't close softly no, our, our kitchen cabinet is this low. This so one. those are just normal yeah. ball bearing uh, sliders. Yeah, this is fine. Okay. Alright. Alright, so we're just having some plain drawer openings and closings in here. It's actually really long, so these are really big this drawers. This is good quality. I remember when I was working at Ashley, our glider is actually. Really basic, it's like from here and then this one. This is a monster one that comes out really, really a long ways and it has really nice ball bearings. It's really loaded full of ball bearings. Yes, see all the ball bearings. It's actually a, a decent one. Anyways, we'll come back in the afternoon. We'll see how, well, how much he's got done. See if we got a drawer we can play with. Just entertaining myself for you guys, but these guys up here, are doing the electrical work up there. They gotta do some splicings and stuff, so they're having fun upstairs. Alright, so we are doing a little bit of movement. This is actually gonna be a free CCTV. Right here, it's nice and easy and close, and I can supervise. So we're moving this. They punched it through in the wrong spot, so we're gonna move it where it's center so we can see everybody that comes up. Alright, and the fun begins. The wires. I guess we are going to find the back ones. Nice. Oh, so we're going to really have fun. Alright, and he is testing to find which one since our old electrician put it in and didn't mark anything. So he has to go through all the wires. At least we separate them from the top and the bottom ones. So we're able to know which ones are what. But it still sucks. I mean, he has to go through a bunch of wires to find out what is what because nothing is marked. We found it and... All right, so he put master in front of our, uh, our master stair door. So each one of these lines are gonna have their markings. Either gonna find them out and then put them on, which is awesome. And there's another one they are working on right now. All right, and you see he on the balcony, so he is writing down, taped it all up, and now he knows and we know exactly where it belongs to, which is great. Life is good now. So I wanted to show you guys, and they put flashing up here. They put it in, they're waiting to get some caulking to put back here and seal it all in. And then they will do over on this side, they still got some work to do up here so they're not done up here on the roofing. And that's why the other guy is using a handsaw. The foreman's actually cutting cabinetry stuff up for their next build. 
Well, here's all the rest of the gliders for the drawers for the house. Other than the kitchen stuff, the kitchen stuff's all got a bunch of special stuff. The, the slow co closing ones, we have like the little racks for dishes and glasses and all that fun fancy stuff and the trash bins that go have their fixed settings in the, underneath the everything so yeah that's all to come all right look what we got going on finally one week later after i asked it to be done it is getting done they're capping off the top of these of our little cabinet area i just didn't want to get forgotten about even though it's up there nobody really looks at it but it's still part of the house still needs to be squared off and skimmed and do all the fancy stuff to it I mean, it's out, of, it's out of the weather, so it ain't gonna hurt anything. Make the house look better. Standing on an old paint can. All right, and they are working on the cabinetry in our downstairs bedroom now. And we still got tiling going on while the fix, because it was hollow in here. So now he is fixing this area. Uh, looks like a few more tiles to go. I'm not sure if they're gonna fill them in because of the electrical. I think they got some more stuff to go on over here for the electrical. Alright, it is a wonderful afternoon. Look what we got done. They got, it looks like they got the wall halfway done. They got another side to do. Which is the, the shack is sort of in the way. So it'll be interesting. I think they're gonna take the walls down. And we have Rangers visit. Welder is busy building the second piece of the accordion gate. All right, and well, the tops of these, uh, the cabinet for the water system is complete. They just need to skim coat it probably maybe tomorrow. I don't know. We'll see. It's built up, so we'll see how that comes out. This uh, little cabinet and little desk in this room is the shell pretty much built and they just got a few inserts the wood on the inside and then like the drawer area I looks like there's gonna be a set of four drawers in there and then they'll have a little topper up here on top for storage also all right and they got these tiles set Definitely tell how unsquare the room is, how on the all the way around the outside tiles cut a little bit differently here and there. I forgot to mention, you can see my wonderful shadow. We got a little bit of S1 sand, so now these guys tomorrow can start doing some more tiling. All right, and here is the fun. It's looking like they have two drawers built. Almost. They're building the front, the front drawers right now, and then they will have a uh, cover plating over the top of them. And Ranger in his favorite spot of the house. Unfortunately, once the house is done being built, he won't be getting this wonderful breeze up here anymore. Probably going to end up being mostly an outside dog. All right. So. My understanding, this little area that we're looking at, the guy's painting, is actually going to be our final coat of color, of white, here in this section. A lot more to go. A lot, lot more to go. Well, I think, I think actually all the ceilings are done too. I'm not 100% sure. I thought it was primer, but I think it's part of white paint too. That's about it for today. They should be almost 5 o'clock. You guys are getting ready to go, so I'm gonna be off. We'll continue this video tomorrow morning. Good morning. Today is a wonderful Thursday, August 27th. And it's another wonderful day. We did not have rain in 24 hours. <laughs> Weird. But these guys are busy digging. You can actually see they didn't put much of a skin coat on our fencing. You can see right through it where all the, each hollow block is at. These guys are digging out the rest all the way up to this little stake right here. It's going to be our fence. Maybe they're going to keep on going. I know we're going to concrete some of this area over here. Alrighty, and the fun continues with the welder. My most exciting part 
of the day is already just uh, check in on the welder and see how much he did get done or how much he didn't get done. I'm not sure how to put it. Cabinet building still going on. Oh, and I see Foreman has some sliding drawers. So they're building up the sliding drawers for inside the bedroom downstairs. Nice. It's actually a nice size. It's really big and deep. You can get all kinds of uh, different clothes in, uh, in those little drawers. So here's our dirty kitchen. A nice look out of it. Pretty much clean. Of course, this wonderful mess right here has to be done a little bit differently because it's right here next to the water. I'm, you know, our new electrician's not uh, too happy the way the setup is here, so he's gonna do some changes to it. It's actually interesting that I see the foreman has, he's actually building up the drawers and putting the sliders in it instead of building the whole cabinetry. It's a little bit different way of uh, doing it compared to what he did upstairs. Oh. Oh, there's a drawer, slides in and out, locks in the place. They're not slow guide and push in type ones, but they will work. If they ever break, I guess we can always replace them. Uh, the foreman having his fun. I guess it's probably easier to take do it this way to put the drawers in as they build it up instead of trying to build them in. Yeah, it's better to put them in as they build it up and then build the whole thing and then go back and put everything back in it, I guess. Easier. Here's the cabinet. Looking like five of the drawers done. Working on another one. The guys are having their fun digging. It's actually surprising they don't put these deeper. Maybe a half a meter deep. That's looking like to me. Not sure. Exactly. Drawers getting put together. He's putting some wood glue on it right now. I'm putting some some nails in it. All right, and we now have another piece of flashing up here. So we have the little cap on here. We have flashing, and then the drain. To me, it looks like it needs some sealant and uh, some extra nails. So everything is blowing that way, and it'll come up underneath here. And we get the wind from that way uh, in the falls, which is where your typhoons and stuff comes from. We'll see how it goes. He's going to have to put some more nails. I'm sure he will. And put some silicone in those so we don't have any issues there. And we have this going on. You can see the, the little flashing against here. It's prepping. I know they're going to put silicone in there. I don't know if they have the silicone for this to keep it. Keep the water out and fill everything up. Okay, so... What I'm looking at right here with this yellow wiring ends, that is going to be a little switch for a couple light bulbs. We're putting up some really cheap little light bulbs up there in the roof so you can see up there if you happen to need to go up there. The electrician got a lot more to do up there because he's got some splicing and some other issues he needs to deal with that wasn't done when it should have been but anyways we requested a, a couple light bulbs in there so when they're when people will go access up there and walk around i will have to have a flashlight or if we can just peek our heads up and flip a switch on we can see what's going on looky looky it is a wonderful afternoon and these guys have been busy something must not be right Foreman's over here helping these guys get our columns up for our fence. But they got a nice big old hole dug out though. And we got the rebar all made up for our little fence. And it looks like everything just got torn down. So I'm not sure what's going on. <laughs> the welder. Everybody is busy. Here's some more cabinetry getting made. He's about to zip the wheel saw down this piece of wood. He's uh, sawing out the next little hangers, I guess you could call. It's the framing for the, the next set of cabinets, wherever they're going to make it. No. Alright, 
So he is cutting out the little slats for hanging up the cabinets. Uh, looks like they actually might be doing it in the storage area. But let's go see what they got done in the bedroom and then we'll go check a look at the storage area. Maybe if that's what they're doing. All right, so it's looking like they got the drawers built up and the cabinet is getting put together. Just trying to make the top work and fit right now. He's trying to cut out the little corner for the column that's right there. So he's just whacking it out and trying to make it fit square. All right, so if you notice something, I really hope they really didn't leave it like that because that's not gonna work for me. They're gonna have to take that off and rebuild that. I don't know why they left it like that with that big old missing piece. He's drilling out the holes for the little cement nail. Yes, very short cord. <laughs> so he ran out of cord, so he's done drilling. He's always adjusting, I guess, or not so much. But this is our shelving for this side of the room is what's going on. So I guess this room is the one that's being built next. So, so we got six drawers done. He still got three more to go. Oh, and some rubber coatings going on. And they also did the underneath where it was leaking. So that's good. So we shouldn't have any more leakings going on up there on our little porch. All right, everybody. That is it for our video. Yes, it is. I hope you enjoyed this wonderful video. Give it a thumbs up if you liked it. Don't forget to subscribe if you have not subscribed and hit that bell button right down there in that corner to get notified next videos. Thank you and goodbye. <laughs>